So I'm going to talk about the role of chemotherapy in early stage metastatic seminoma, which is a very controversial um, setting. Um, these patients are usually cured. Um, the cure rate is 98% in experience center with chemotherapy or radiation therapy. So there are two treatment options that are gold standard for these patients. And um, um, the issue here is not uh, whether or not chemotherapy is uh, efficacious. efficacious. The, the issue is like to cure these patients so keeping that 98% of the cure rate, sparing the long-term toxicity of these patients. So my, my talk will focus mainly on that aspect. So uh, what we can do best to uh, keep that 98% cure rate, but decreasing, decreasing the long-term toxicity. So um, because the fact that we can cure these patients doesn't mean that everyone needs toxic treatment. So I will touch base about the role and importance of microRNA 371 to do a better job in patient selection to reduce the risk of over-treatment in patients with early stage metastatic seminoma. And I'll also mention the new um, uh, strategies that are based on non-chemotherapy and non-radiation therapy options, um, primarily with uh, um, RPL in, the, in these patients with metastatic seminoma, and uh, uh, the new kind of trials that will be informed by microRNA status.